What are we making? Bath bomb! Welcome back, gorgeous mama. Are you wondering how to use essential oils to make some small gift ideas for Valentine's Day? If you are feeling overwhelmed trying to stay on top of all of the holidays and everything going on, you're slightly tired, extremely burnt out from parenting, and you have zero help from your extended family, you found the right video to show you inexpensive gift ideas. This video will give you all the steps you need, the material, and trust me, it's not hard or I wouldn't have been able to make it that ease those feelings of overwhelm and give you that help from your new extended family, me and this community. Hi, I'm Stephanie Caldron, mom to two daughters ages 10 and 15, married for 17 years to my best friend, essential oil educator, certified essential oil specialist, and someone who has learned hands-on natural health tips, and I've been sharing them over the past 15 years. Click the subscribe button and hit that bell so you can be notified every time I upload a new video. Make sure you stick around to the end because I have a fun free download for you. We also have a special guest, so we're gonna head over to the kitchen and we're gonna get started. Super fun DIY project, making your own essential oil bath bombs. What are we making? Bath bombs. Yeah, you like bath bombs, but they can be pretty pricey when they're getting the all natural one, or when you're getting the cheap ones, you're getting the synthetic fragrances, which is not good for your skin, not good to breathe in. So we're gonna make our own. Yeah. Ready? Okay, so we are going to start with two cups of baking soda. You wanna be the mixer? Yeah. We've got one. One. And then two. And then we have one cup of cornstarch. I'm a pretty messy baker maker type of a person. <laughs> and then what? one cup of Epsom salt. Make sure you find the kind that's unscented because it would have synthetic fragrances in it otherwise. So we're going to do one cup of Epsom salt. You can start mixing it with it a whip. It looks like snow. One cup of citric acid. This I ordered on Amazon. The rest are pretty common ingredients that you can find She's kind just of about anywhere. We are doing 12 to 16 teaspoons of coconut oil. Oh, chunky dope. All right, now you're gonna have to really start mixing because we're getting the solid part of it in. Okay. This would make a really good gift. I saw some cute tags that you could make for Valentine's Day where it said like, you're the bomb.com and put them in a cute cellophane and give them away as Valentine's gifts. Really inexpensive gifts because all of these again are pretty common ingredients. Oh, those are really getting chunky. I can't really get them. They're just as messy as I am. Okay, you're gonna have to come down a little bit or we're not gonna have anything left in the bowl. Then we need to add some water. <gasps> It's fuzzling like a bath bomb. <laughs> oh, it's getting hard now. Ooh. Eliana picked Serenity essential oil, really calming. So we're gonna do about 12 drops. So just mix it all together really, really well. Oh wow, it smells good. How I like my bath. I realized I already made a mistake, so hopes it's okay. I was doing the bigger tablespoon, but I wasn't filling it up. So hopefully this works. Okay, you want me to stir it for a while? Yeah. Okay. Just want to get it all combined together. What's next after that? I think we need a little bit more water. Ooh, that's perfect. You really smell it now. And then we add it to our molds. Go and pick out which molds you want. I really want the heart. Okay, so then you're just going to pack it in there. Can I do the other mold? Yep, go for it. You're gonna pack it in there, and then it has to sit for, leave it in the middle, because I'll do some too. Oh, okay. Um, five minutes until it's hard, and then it has to cure for 24 hours. We forgot this stuff, Eliana. Where's the food coloring? Right over there. Oh, yeah. You can also add food coloring to different parts of it if you want. Um, this is a natural food coloring, so it's not artificial. Do you want to add colors to the whole thing, or do you want to add it to the little ones that you're sticking in there? Yeah, I'm going to add to the little ones that I'm sticking in there. Okay, what color do you want? I want this one like red. Yep. Perfect. We'll get lighter. And then I'm gonna put a little bit over it, so it's kind of like a surprise. You don't know what color it is. It's like a surprise. Because when the water goes in, it should launch the color out. 
And there you have it, your very own DIY natural essential oil bath bombs as perfect gifts for Valentine's Day. If you give this a try, we'd love to hear how it goes. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more fun DIYs and essential oil recipes. Thanks for joining us today. Together, we can make this journey of parenthood a little more informed and a lot more fulfilling. You've got this, Mama. As promised, you can download your free copy of my Kids Safe Essential Oils list. You can find the link in the description and pinned in the comments. Go snag it now to have this amazing free resource at your fingertips. Happy crafting and have a wonderful Valentine's Day. Bye.